EasyMutt.com. Use code Q. Get 10% off right now. Stop gambling your money. Go save your money. Go get the team you want. Go have the fun you want. Go get the players you want. All right, guys, we're back. Safety tier list. Let's clear up the picture here for you so you know who to get before you buy. Save your coins. So if this helped you, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new. I just did the top 10 budget beast. Now, let's go ahead and jump straight into this. Buda Baker, wow. Uh, B tier. <laughs> you're probably thinking, no, he has to be A. He's, he's a 90. No, his abilities, well, they don't exist. He doesn't get KOs. Uh, he's missing a million things when it comes to that. Yeah, uh, this card here does not do what I want it to do. I want my safety have 90 man, 90 zone. He does not have that. So there you go. Now, moving right along here, uh, Ed Reed. Uh, this card here, this 87, is not as good as this 87. All right. This 87 here gets KOs. This 87 does not. So please do not buy the newer card thinking, well, he's got to be updated. Actually, this card is worse. So if you want KOs, this card will not get it. This card is going to be what you want in that situation. Paul Krauss is going to be A tier. He has 90 zone. He's 6'3". He's big. He actually does do some damage with his hit power. And I will say this guy here is going to be good enough to be on your team. And if you run him on a team team, get a speedy boost. He's just going to be that much better. Now, with that being said, Paul Krauss too, if you run man, you can't put him in the game. So, up next, Isaiah. Isaiah's going to be A tier. Why? Because he can't run him in man and zone. You can run him in zone. He's a great user. If you're just talking about as a pure user, he can be S tier as a user. He's going to be great. He's big. He's tall. He's he's hard to throw the ball over his head because he's so big. So, if you're playing against the Calvins and the Mosses, this guy here is going to be a great option for you to stop the jump ball. Now, Moving right along here, Troy Palmalu, S tier. Love this card. 90 man, 90 zone. You put him wherever you want, any scheme, guess what he's going to do? He's going to help you because he has those thresholds. He's going to play great man and zone. He has good KOs. I really like this card. Go pick him up if you haven't. He's at a good price right now. Willie Cooker is nothing special. Missing abilities, missing speed. Please do not get that card. Sean Taylor is going to be right here with a Paul Krause. I do like Paul Krause a little bit better. Uh, he does get 90 man, uh, I mean, sorry, he does get 90 zone like Paul Krause, but since Krause is bigger, I like Krause a little bit better, I will say, uh, however, this Sean Taylor, if you run man, you can't even use this card, all right, you really can't, so just keep that in mind if you're trying to run man, Justin Simmons is going to be A tier, can't run man, he has good size, good hit power, and he's fine, but if you need to run man, he's going to be a horrible fit for your scheme. He has some pretty good height to stop the jump ball, and he doesn't have good hit power. Hit power does matter, guys, because there's going to be times that you're trying to get to the pick. You can't get there, and guess what? You need some like, hit power to knock the ball out because now that's your only chance for an incompletion. And this guy does not really give you great hit power. So keep that in mind. Phillips is S tier. 90 man, 90 zone. 90 player. This guy's very intelligent. He jumps in front of people. You put him anywhere. He does anything. I just don't like him in a jump ball situation. He's not the biggest. But besides that, uh, he's just better. He's just a better Troy because he's faster. There you go. So, yeah, this guy here, Phillips, you're going to want him. You really are. Isaiah Simmons uh, doesn't have 90 man, 90 zone. He is right here at the end of A tier or beginning of B tier, okay? I'm gonna put him B tier because he didn't have 90 man or zone. So he didn't hit those thresholds. He's gonna be a good user. But if you're talking about users, then Isaiah's better. So if somebody's better, you gotta go down a tier. Jesse Bates, bad, bad abilities. Please do not get this card. Uh, bad speed, all of that. Same thing with Hickman. Uh, abilities missing, speed missing. Please don't get that card. Uh, Rodney Lott, this card here, Wow. Um, you can't play man and zone with him. He's missing abilities. I, You can use him. He's going to be the, like, the best to beat here, I would say, because he doesn't have 90 zone. you got to put a strat card on him. You can't give him 90 zone. This man's not good enough. So just keep that in mind that this guy here, uh, just the stock card, is not going to play as good as these guys in zone with 90 zone. And by the way, guys, if you get Isaiah to... 90 man with the strike card, then he is S tier. So you're really thinking about 
getting a card to, to really boost that might be the card you actually want to boost now up next ed reed's gonna be best of eight tier because he doesn't get 90 man but guess what he gets he gets 90 zone so he's gonna be really good he does a lot of his sticks by himself he's very aggressive he's great against the run because well he throws his sticks and he gets you fumbles actually it's not that common but he has done that for me and i will say getting the ball out he can do that with this hit stick and yes i think this card here is aggressive good and has good speed so yes give ed reed a chance hooker is going to be eight here guys he is just uh really just a smaller justin simmons he doesn't give you 90 man he gives you 90 zone uh he's too small compared to others i would just go get simmons instead uh just because of his height basically but yeah, I, I'm not a big fan of this hooker card, really. Uh, you could put really Krause ahead of him, because I like Krause's height. And I really think that helps against getting the ball. And there's Curse, guys. Curse is here. He does not get 90 man. So he gets 90 zone. He's big. He's a good user. He's tall. I, I like that this guy here actually is free. If you grind for him. He is way down the accomplice, I get it. But if you get this card, he's gonna be on your team for a while. Just the one thing I don't like about Curse is his hit power, right? So there's gonna be times, there's gonna be, you're gonna have a clear hit on a running back and it ain't gonna matter because he didn't have any hit power. Uh, just keep that in mind, he's more of a user kind of guy and Rodney Lott is the best in the game and it's not really close. Uh, Rodney Lott, 90 man, 90 zone, uh, hit power, block shed, all that, all the abilities. You can really just pimp this card out with so many abilities. Rodney Lott is going to be the best. Uh, he's very aggressive, very intelligent. Go get him. That's going to do it for me, guys. That was a safety tier list. Go check out the last video. Top 10 budget cards. I'll see you then. Be kind to everyone.